Welcome to TechScope, your gateway to real tech breakdowns, not just the hype. And today's topic might just sound too good to be true. Imagine this, a smartphone that looks and feels like a flagship offers a DSLR grade 200 megapixel camera, a massive 8,000 milliamp hour battery, 120 watt super fast charging and 5G connectivity, all for just 11,999 rupees? Sounds insane, right? A recent viral report claims Realme has launched a phone with exactly those specs. But let's not get carried away. We'll take a closer look. What's real, what's exaggerated, and what it actually means for budget smartphone buyers in 2025. 1. Design. Flagship looks on a budget. According to the buzz, this Realme phone is designed to look like a high-end flagship with a glass-like back finish, premium contours, and a large camera island that gives serious Pro Edition vibes. It supposedly adopts a curved edge display, a feature usually seen on phones priced above 30,000 rupees. What's more? It might come with stereo speakers, an in-display fingerprint sensor, and metallic side rails. If true, this would be a serious game changer in the sub 15K market, giving users a design experience once reserved for premium segments. Two, camera. Is 200 megapixels even possible at this price? Here's the jaw dropper, a 200 megapixel primary sensor, which sounds like something pulled from the Realme 11 Pro Plus or Xiaomi 13T Pro. DSLR level photography is a bold promise. This kind of sensor would typically be a Samsung Isocell HP3, a powerful, high-resolution sensor that needs good processing power and software to perform well. But here's the challenge. Camera quality doesn't come from megapixels alone. Image processing, lens quality, and chipset performance all play a massive role. Unless Realme is using a very advanced ISP, image signal processor, and strong AI optimization, the raw megapixel number might be more about marketing than real-world results. Still, if the phone features even a mid-tier 200 megapixel sensor with decent tuning, it could deliver stunning detail in daylight and digital zoom advantages rarely seen at this price. 3. Battery and Charging, the 8,000 milliamp hour powerhouse. A claimed 8,000 milliamp hour battery? That's entering tablet level capacity. If true, this phone would easily offer two to three days of regular usage, perfect for gamers, travelers, or users in rural areas where charging isn't always available. Pair that with 120 watt Super VOOC charging, and you're looking at a phone that could go from zero to 100% in just 25 to 30 minutes. That's faster than many laptops charge. But here's a red flag. Charging such a large battery at 120 watts requires serious thermal management and battery safety protocols, which are expensive to implement. Realme typically reserves this for upper mid-range or flagship phones. Could they have somehow optimized cost and scaled this tech to budget users? Or is it more of a prototype tease? 4. Performance. Dimensity 9200 plus for 11,999 rupees? Really? If reports are accurate, this phone is powered by the MediaTek Dimensity 9200 Plus, a top-tier 5G chipset known for flagship performance. Built on TSMC's 4 nanometer architecture, it supports high frame rate gaming, advanced AI features, and efficient power draw. With 12 gigs of RAM and 256 gigs of storage, it would put the phone in the same league as flagship killers like the IQ9 Nevo and Redmi K70. But realistically, the Dimensity 9200 Plus alone costs more than this entire phone's price tag, so this may be a case of spec confusion, either an incorrect listing or mixing multiple models into one dream phone. It's more likely the phone runs a Dimensity 6100 Plus or Helio G99 Ultra, which are still solid for budget 5G performance. 5. Connectivity OS and other features. The phone is rumored to feature 5G dual SIM support, which is standard in 2025, Android 14 with Realme UI 5.0, IP54 splash resistance, Wi-Fi 6, Bluetooth 5.3, and NFC support, expandable storage via micro SD card slot, side-mounted or under-display fingerprint sensor. 
These features would make the phone truly future-ready, especially NFC, which is often skipped in budget phones. 6. Real or Hype? What you should know. Now, let's be real. There is no official Realme launch announcement or listing that confirms all these specs. It's highly likely this viral story is based on a mix of high-end Realme models like the Realme 11 Pro Plus, some marketing leaks, and possibly AI-generated renderings. Realme is known for launching value-packed devices, but a $1499 phone with all flagship features? As of today, there's no confirmation, and it's almost certainly too good to be true. Be cautious if you see pre-order ads or listings claiming these specs at this price. So, is this the best smartphone deal of the decade, or is it just a viral spec mashup fantasy? As of now, we're leaning towards clever marketing or a rumor spiral. While Realme does push the boundaries of price to performance, it's unlikely they've dropped a 200 megapixel, 8,000 milliamp hour, 120 watt flagship at $1499. But one thing is clear, if any brand can shake up the entry-level market, it's Realme. Keep your eyes on official announcements and don't fall for fake leaks. Subscribe to TechScope and we'll make sure you only get verified, honest breakdowns of the tech you care about. Like what you heard? Smash that like, hit subscribe, and drop your thoughts below. Would you buy this phone if it were real? Stay tuned, because at TechScope, we decode the future of tech without the fiction.